Now, British Prime Minister Boris Johnson will face the parliament after narrowly fending off a no-confidence vote brought by his own party. The embattled Prime Minister will appear before lawmakers while he's confronted with a gradual political crisis. Now, in Monday's no-confidence vote, more than 40% of his own MPs had voted against him. Johnson called the vote a convincing result, but critics say it's just the beginning of the end. Johnson has vowed to plough on, but the Prime Minister's team will try to regain the offensive. The rebels will push to remove him. Despite his narrow victory in the no-confidence vote, The Guardian reported that rebel conservative MPs are drawing up plans for vote strikes. The move will aim to paralyse the government's legislative agenda. Some of the 148 MPs who voted to ask Johnson would try to impede the government's proposed legislations by abstaining on key laws. The face-off may begin with a new bill which overrides the Northern Ireland Protocol. The Northern Ireland Bill is expected to be published this or the next week. A huge backlash is expected to be given to a Johnson-led government's authority and had publicly been undermined. Similar events happened at the end of former Prime Minister Theresa May's era as well. The I newspaper also said that Prime Minister now faces a war of attrition. Under current Tory rules, the Prime Minister cannot be challenged again for a year. This leaves little time for any new leader to emerge before the next general election due by 2024. But the party's committee that oversees leadership challenges says it could easily change the rules if a majority backs it. After Johnson survived the Tory revolt, the Liberal Democrats are now pushing for a parliamentary no-confidence vote. If the government lost a no-confidence motion in the House of Commons, it would have to call a snap general election. Clearly, Johnson is about to face a challenging period in the months ahead. Beyond is now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.